Yeah, that looks good. All right, guys, it has been a while. Um, and today, it's the 1st of January and a new year, 2017. And I thought I'd share with you my New Year's resolutions for this year. Because it might be interesting, but also because of accountability. Very often we make ourselves these promises that we don't necessarily keep. And I think that putting this out there uh, in this format will really sort of force me to uh, live up to these promises to myself. And I've got five New Year's resolutions this year. Number one, it's really sort of simple, but I'm going to work out at least once a week. And that's really... Uh, not a very ambitious goal, but that's kind of the point because I know I can do it um, and I want to work out more, but that's going to be my resolution for this year is at least once a week with no exceptions. The next one, number two, this is also kind of taking care of uh, health like in a different way. I used to meditate uh, daily. You might remember that from some of my earlier vlogs. So I'm going to do... Uh, a 20-minute session of meditation every single day for 2017. Number three is a little bit different. Uh, it's gonna need a little bit of a backstory. I don't know if you know this, but last year, 2016, we, my girlfriend and I, we did a uh, a year uh, without any alcohol. So we had a gap year from alcohol, which was interesting uh, and surprisingly easy. Um, so we decided we wanted to do something a little bit uh, similar this year. So we're doing a year without any refined sugar. Which might sound a little bit crazy to some people, but I have a suspicion it's going to be a little bit more easy than expected. We would actually have done a month without refined sugar once. And we like doing these experiments. We had like, we had one like raw food month and I think it'd be interesting to do an entire year because you don't really learn a lot in a month but in a year maybe I don't know anyway moving on number four is not as measurable it's more of a general kind of thing and that is that I want to be a little bit more structured and make lists and plan things a little bit better than I have done um, so basically making daily lists of what I need to do and what I want to do, what I want to get out of the day. It'll be interesting and hopefully fruitful. It's not as measurable as the other uh, resolutions, but I think it's going to be uh, valuable anyway. My fifth and final resolution is that I'm going to be uploading a video every single week. I'm currently a full-time student and I'm working on the side, so I kind of feel like I don't have time for that. But what kind of pushes, pushed me to do this is two things. On the one hand, uh, there's this expression that's called, if you want something done, ask someone who's busy. And I kind of want to be that person who, who gets stuff done. And it seems to me that the best way to realize that is to do a lot of different things. And that will kind of put me in a space where I'm uh, able to do a lot of things. The second reason is that I just really enjoy making these videos. It's a kind of a creative outlet that's a little bit different from what I'm doing at school and otherwise and it's a little bit challenging and I like that I just enjoy doing it for some reason after I got back to Norway I just haven't um, made any videos and I don't know why there's no particularly good reason why I think because when we were traveling the videos were uh, about traveling it was traveling, travel vlog, but now that I'm back in Norway, I guess it's more about me because I'm not 
traveling. I don't know. It looks like I'm filming at the middle of the night, but it's actually like 6.30 and it, it just this is Norway. So those were my New Year's resolutions for this year. I'm super excited. I hope you found it interesting. Uh, I want to kind of add just a little thing at the end here uh, about New Year's resolutions. And if you want to make them happen, um, I think that there's mainly two things that are really important. That it should be measurable. So you can actually see every day or every week, am I, did, did I do it this week? Did I do it this today. Um, a lot of New Year's resolutions are very goal oriented, like I'm gonna get there, but that it's not really measurable. But like say that like um, you have a goal that's more like I'm gonna do this habit or I'm gonna do this thing every day or every week. That's measurable and usually that lets you know that you're on the right way. The second thing is that's really important is accountability and for me that's putting this up on YouTube. Uh, I'll put a button up maybe there uh, if you want to subscribe. Let me know you're using New Year's resolutions if you have any in the comments down below and I'll be posting a new video every week every Thursday so stay tuned. Alright, I think that's everything. Bye!